which is two or more items. There are a number of spelling rules that we are going to learn. So if the suffix ends with the letter A, we are going to simply add an E and change the end to AE. So in this case, a scapula, which is your shoulder blade, ending in just the A is a single scapula. But scapulae with the AE is plural, meaning two, and you do have two of them. If the suffix ends in the letters US, you are going to change the US to the letter I. So for example, a syllabus right, is a single object, so one syllabus or one packet. But if you're referring to multiple, you would change the US to letter I and refer to it as syllabi. If a suffix ends with an ON or a UM, you are going to change to a letter A. So the word pericardium ends in the UM, and that would be singular. Pericardia, by changing the UM to the A, would make it a plural and refer to multiple. If the suffix ends in an IS, we are going to change it to an ES to make it plural. So a diagnosis is singular, meaning they have one disease. But diagnoses with the ES ending changes it to having a multiple designation or a plural designation. Next, if a suffix ends in the letters ITIS, to make it plural, we are going to change the letters to IDES. So for example, arthritis refers to a singular event or joint. Arthritis refers to multiple or plural joints of the body. If the suffix ends in an EX or an IX, we are going to change it to ICES. So you do have an appendix. An appendix is one object. But if you are referring to more than one appendix, you would refer to it as an appendices with the ICES ending attached to the end. If your suffix ends in the letters NX, we are going to change it to GES. The example here is the phalanx. A phalanx refers to the bone in a finger or a toe. In order to make it plural, you would change it to the GES ending. So a phalanges would refer to multiple fingers or multiple bones inside the fingers or toes. If your suffix ends in a Y, you are going to change it to an IES set of lettering. The term cardiopathy is singular, but the term cardiopathies is a plural term, referring to more than one. And last but not least, if a suffix ends in an X, we are going to change it to a CES ending. The word thorax refers to a single chest. The word thoraces with the CES changed ending refers to more than one chest cavity.